G'day guys, I was just at a massive competition where they were giving out free cubes. There was some cube company recently that stopped selling cubes and the guy was there and basically he was just giving out all this old stock, right? And I managed to get my hands on a few of them. So I've got five cubes that are probably 10, 15 years old that are basically the very first speed cubes. Now as someone starting cubing in like 2016, I don't exactly know the significance of any of these cubes. So let me know if you ever had any of these. But I'm gonna get started with one of these that I probably should have had in my collection before. Instructions, quick unboxing, there you go. If there's a year on this, I'm not sure because you know, it's all in Chinese. Let's have a look. So yeah, Rubik's snake or just snake puzzle or whatever you want to call it. I've definitely seen these before, but I've never had one for myself. Let's open it up. Here we go. Yeah, I mean, it's a Rubik snake. I don't really know what you do with this. Like, is there patterns and stuff? Is there like world records for this kind of thing? I don't really know. I guess you could do something like this. Wow, pretty cool, but I'm more interested in the cubes. This is a Xing Xiao? Yeah, no date here, not. 2003. Okay, so 20 years ago. I didn't actually realize that these are so old. This was probably used in like the very first competitions, possibly. Let's see if there's any more information. So there's actually no name of this. It's just Xing Xiao Cube Speed Edition, which, you know, cool. Um, yep, instructions on how to solve it. Yeah, half English, half Chinese. Nothing really exciting. All right, so this is the cube. So it's actually not terrible, but I guess compared to a modern speed cube, it's obviously not great. So let's stick it, obviously, you know, very locky, but overall, it's not the worst cube I've ever felt. Now I'm gonna do a solve on all of these at the end and see which one I can do the fastest on. All right, next one, Moyu. Moyu, Li Ying, three layer cube, sure. Uh, this one also says 2003. Now I don't know if that's the manufacturing date, it probably wasn't because it has a picture of Felix Zemdegs on it, but still, there you go, it was $12. I didn't pay that. <laughs> Look how young Felix looks. There you go, 6.54. We have a look. 6.54 average in 2013. So there you go, like 11 years ago or something, I guess. All right, let's check this one out. I guess this was what uh, Felix was using at the time. There you go, there's another picture of him. So I guess this was when he was with Moryu and like Gan wasn't really a thing yet. Oh wow, okay, there's a lot of stuff here. Lots of different cubes. Yeah, there's Felix and there's instructions on how to use it. Wow, so there's some big cubes at the bottom here. I don't know what that is. Is that a, that might've been the 13 by 13. That might've been the biggest cube at the time. Pretty cool. All right, let's check this cube. So back in the day, Felix was known for using his white cubes. I don't really have any white cubes. This is kind of cool. Okay, so this is slightly better. I can see with a bit of setup, this could get pretty good. All right, definitely better than the last one, but you know, we'll see what the next one's like. $15, this one must be better, maybe. Uh, so this is Shuangren, mm, Shuangren. Maybe that's the brand, I'm not sure. Fun's Puzzle. Actually, it's probably Fun's Puzzle, Shuangren, so FS. Sure, let's try it out. All these boxes are so old. There's no uh, date on this one. Okay, there was no instructions in that one. So here, check this out. It's got like this weird ridged sort of thing. Oh, wow, okay. Whoa. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> obviously, ah, very, uh, very loose. Oh, wow, well, this can give us a good look at the pieces. Wow, I've never seen a piece like that before. That's very bizarre. Interlocking sort of thing, I'm not sure. There you go, there's like sort of an early spider core. Let's give it a try. Okay, this one's definitely better, but I don't know if it's just looser, but I think, nah, it's, it's definitely a better mechanism. All right, very nice, I like that one a lot better. And finally, <laughs> Yeah, I'm not looking forward to solving this. This was $4. I didn't actually pay any of this. They're all just given out for free. Oh, this one's in plastic. Wow. This one says 2003 as well. I don't think that's the correct date, but anyway. Oh, there we go. All right, now it's all five by five as well. That's interesting. I guess they just put the same instructions in every box. Yeah, this is literally all in Chinese. Not useful for me, but it's a good thing I already know how to solve a four by four. Also, it's a Mofang, I forgot to mention. It's a Mofang, I don't know, that. You know a lot of stuff, but let's open it. No one has touched this before. Okay, there's a sticker over the top of the logo. So I guess we're meant to peel it off, kind of, maybe. The logo is not even centered. All right, let's give this one a try. Okay, I mean, it's not terrible, but I guess growing up with magnetic cubes, these have always just felt terrible to me. Very locky, but you know, for a four by four at the time, I'm sure it was really good. And I don't have a white four by four, so that's cool. All right, we're gonna do some solves. All right, let's go. I'm gonna start with a really bad Xing Xiao thing. Uh, I guess I'll just give it a hand scramble. I don't really care. All right, let's go. Oh, I feel like I'm chipping the stickers off with my fingers. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't really want to do that again. 17 seconds, not terrible. Next one, we'll try the uh, the white one. Let's see if I can get the world record of Felix's. Oh, this one actually also has a sticker on top. I didn't realize. I'll probably take that off. Oh, jeez. So 
So with white cubes, my recognition's terrible. All right, 14, getting slightly faster. Now let's try this one. This one should be interesting. I wonder how many world records Felix broke with this. Last one. This is the first time this cube has ever been solved. All right, let's go. On 13. All right. Yeah, overall, not as bad as I thought, but you know, some of these I would never use in a competition these days because they're just way too old. Let me know if you have any of these cubes. But anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.